Hello. This is an experiment. I would not do this if I was you. This is not safe what I'm doing. It's just an experiment. Candle power. It's really one set of candles up a step. It looks like multitudes of candles, but it's not just one set of candles, five all together. And you can look at the temperature of the candles it's producing. I put the fans on, it was 160, 165. I put the fans to circulate the heat. As you can see, this is the temperature blowing around. The two fans, stove top fans, um, wooden fans, wood, uh, wood burning for stove fans, proper name. Sorry about that. Taste. I'm taking me. I got this from the um, flea market, and I cleaned it up. I'm tired, but um, this is the temperature it puts out, and it really does put warmness around. It's better than nothing. But I'm using the um, the gauge right there to hold the um, fan up in the air, and then it shows you how much temperature is blowing off of it from out of the um, base. It's really more than that. It's about 180 out of the base, out of the glass. These are things you could do to stay warm in an apartment for power outage. I like the little cups because when they burn out, when they cool off, you can just discard them and put new ones in. This is the temperature. These fans are on both sides, one facing opposing to each other. And it circulates the heat easier. I'm just showing you ways of, you know, just a, just a side view of it. So let me set a glass. But do not do this. This is not safe. I don't recommend it. But in emergency, you do what you have to do. This has a metal base, so it's not damaging the, um, the surface. All right. I'm just showing you what you can do. You could probably put a piece of metal up, but you just smother it. So you can't, you got to have a certain air pocket in the middle like I do. To, um, you know, circulate the air. So the heat that forces the heat to come around and go up makes it hotter. But then it's cooling in effect around the glass area. So it's not, you know, it's not overheating the glass. Oops, let me put the tongue right on as you can see, the temperature is going up to 150. Well, there's things you could do to stay warm. You know, people don't know how to stay warm today. They think it's throwing on this light switch and cutting on this um, energy. It's going to save them during harder winter. God bless. Remember, do not do this. This is not safe.